I think what Harambe represents is this powerful network of incredibly intelligent young men and women who've gone through the strong universities of Europe and North America and China. These young men and women, therefore, have a vision for what it means to change things in the world. They're taking American or British or Chinese models, wanting to take them back to base country and re-engineer. That is, that is an intrinsic strength. It means that the key qualities of intelligence matched with integrity, matched with vision, and I think hopefully matched with co-resourcing will allow Harambians to be the bedrock of the new employment that many countries need. We spend a lot of time, for example, at McKinsey, uh, interviewing people. We get a huge number of applicants, uh, and you know, we spend a lot of time trying to select the best. Uh, I've had the good fortune also of being on selection committees for various things. I, I'm on the selection committee for the Rhodes Scholarship. Again, we're selecting for excellence. So what I think Harambe is doing is the equivalent of that, but for entrepreneurs. Uh, you know, so when I think about how rigorous, you know, whether it's the Rhodes Selection Committee or the uh, you know, McKinsey interviews, whatever have you, Harambe is doing exactly the same thing very rigorously. So it's a very accomplished group, and I think any, I'd challenge anybody to look at the group of Farambians and not be impressed by who they are, uh, first of all, what they've done, what they've accomplished, and the big, the size of the ambition that they have for the kinds of things that they want to do. So it was easy. I think there's an enormous amount of bravery in this alliance and in the people we're working with. Um, they have all the traditional characteristics of entrepreneurs in many ways. They're looking to create prosperity, both for themselves and for broader networks or for investors or others. But more than anything else, they're willing to tackle new ground in a lot of ways and to try to apply the best things that can be learned in the West with the realities and the pragmatism that you have to have for the African context. I think Harambe is providing a pipeline of tried and tested um, entrepreneurial businesses, proposals, ideas. They bring the network um, and they bring seasoned entrepreneurs who would come with proposals that were ready to look at. Um, I'm, I'm amazed, you know, at the talent that Harambi is able to, to, to bring forth. People often ask, you know, The Economist and me, you know, are we, you know, kind of Afro-optimists or Afro-pessimists? And, and frankly, when I spend some time with Harambians, I come out uh, leaning far to the uh, optimistic side.